They say third time's the charm, but the biggest question here today is for who. The Patriots and the Bills are in a series split, which means this wild card game is going to be, well, a wild guess as to who's going to walk away with a win. Buffalo finished the regular season with four straight wins, earning the AFC East title for the second consecutive year, while New England fell flat at the finish line, losing three of their last four matchups. But it's the playoffs, and that means anything goes, records and titles aside. So now all we can do is break down the matchups, key facts and figures to try to predict the unpredictable. For the Patriots, their biggest red flag is at quarterback. I think at times it's easy to forget Mac Jones is in his rookie season, but his recent slow starts and shakiness has led to some uncertainty and this main concern. How will he handle the pressure of his first playoff game? Especially throwing against the Bills' pass defense, who rank first in the league in three key areas, opponent passer rating, fewest passing yards allowed, and fewest touchdown passes. The good news is New England can ground and pound with the best of them, which will also in turn take some pressure off Jones. And similarly, the Bills' biggest red flag is also at quarterback, but for a different reason. Buffalo uses Josh Allen like a crutch, but he's not consistent enough to be their lifeline and safety net, especially at home, considering he's actually better on the road. This especially when the Patriots tout a top-scoring defense with guys like Mr. Interception J.C. Jackson on Allen's top target, Stephon Diggs. And what's a wild card weekend without some wild weather? Temps are expected to hit the single digits in Buffalo tonight. But I saw an interesting and positive fact for Patriots fans, and that's with New England, Bill Belichick is 35 and 9 in freezing games. Until game time, reporting from a slightly warmer Foxborough, Alexia Afredo, the Boston Herald.